Hi folks, my name is Hermit in the Forest. This is my unboxing of Star Saga 1 Beyond the Boundary. This is a combination of computer role-playing game and a board role-playing game. It is a very interesting concept. Um, you should play with your friends. This game is uh, for up to six players. And you and your friends should sit around the computer and play a board role-playing game while the computer itself acts as a dungeon master. So you input the data, uh, input your choices, and the computer advances the story. Um, this game uh, takes place in the far future. So it's a science fiction role-playing game. Uh, takes place in the 29th uh, century, when humanity colonized a big uh, portion of the universe. They colonized other planets. However, in the year 2490, Mm, the humanity was struck by uh, an alien virus that they discovered on some distant planet and half of the humanity died because of it uh, so the response was that uh, the further discoveries into the far space have been stopped and uh, the humanity civilization started to stagnate uh, they placed uh, something called a boundary around the known universe and uh, anyone can, le can leave the boundary but he uh, cannot return back anymore after he leaves uh, so you are playing as a party of explorers who decide to uh, go past the boundary and uh, explore the far uh, space Okay, let's take a look at the box art. It is actually just a text game. There's no graphics. Because, as I said, computer is just a dungeon master. And you read... Let's turn the box around now. To take a look at the back side. You read the booklets present in this big box. And this is how the story advances. Okay, here you can see the contents of this big box. Everything is inside, I will show it to you. Okay, now I open this box and let's take a look inside. First of all, there are these colored tokens, six tokens. Those tokens represent the player characters or the every player that plays this game and you move them on the map that I will show you right in a while so those are the tokens here is the disc with the game for the computer a registration card This should have been a trilogy, but the publisher only, only released uh, two games and then went out of the business, so only two games exist of this series. Uh, and the second game, the Clathra Menace, you can see in my unboxings as well. Here are the instructions for IBM Compatibles. So, how to install and start a game. Now, here are Introductions for the players. That is uh, six leaflets that are all the same, and each player should receive one of this list, one of this leaflet, and read it before uh, starting playing the game. So, yeah, and those are the same. Then there is host guide and player reference manual. Yeah. Warranty. Here are the credits. Take a look at the people who made this game. It is, there is also, as you can see, Andrew Greenberg, written, author of Wizardry series. Now let's take a look at the table of contents. It is about 50 pages. 
this is yeah, info how to start the game, how to set up it. And hints actually. So this is how to set the game right so that the computer works. The computer actually only does some fights, uh, counts numbers and uh, writes what you should read, what uh, part of the books that are present here. Yeah. So this is how you should actually play the game, how the combat works and computer game master user's guide. Yeah, this is the game interface. This is how it looks like actually. As I said, only text, no pictures. Status display, okay. Now here's something about the authors of this game. If you're interested. So this is the host guide. And now finally we get to the booklets with the story itself. There's a lot of these booklets. It's labeled book A, book B and so on up to book M as eight 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 mm, different different pages. So how many books is there? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, I think fourteen. Yeah, thirteen actually. Thirteen books. And you can take a look, for example, for this book. For the first one. Here is how the story starts. And at the end of this page, you should decide what to do, imprint it into your computer, and he will tell you what to do next, what page you should move to. Okay, so these are the books, and then there are mm, booklets of the characters that you play. There are six characters. Each one has a different background, each one is intended for a different player. So yeah, here are the names. Yeah, here you can read some, something about them. Some info that differs for each character and each character can do their own missions uh, the players don't move together but they can separately explore, explore different parts of the space okay so that's this and the last things in the box are the maps the space maps this is the first space map a big uh, small one small paper map with the sectors and here you place the tokens and move on the sectors right okay and the last thing in the box that I will not open because it's still sealed is a map that is the same as the previous I showed you uh, except that it is uh, uh, it has blue background as you can see and it's bigger but otherwise it looks the same it has also the sectors and I show you yeah it is this map as you can see it here so if I would open it then it would lo look like this okay and that is all that was in the box I thank you very much for watching this video